Crooked cake is similar to your expression, but it is food safe. It is meant to cut food. We modified the machine so that it will cut food better than it cuts paper. Your expression cuts paper better than it cuts food. There are no cavities in the machine, so that no food or particles get inside the machine. Uh, the roller has been modified. It's higher so that you have more uh, gap clearance. It'll now cut up to two and a half millimeters. The deep cut is one and a half millimeter. The blade and blade housing has been modified, and there's a protectant on the blades so that you no know, food or particles get up inside your blade to stop your blade from spinning. Okay. Everything's food safe. Stainless steel rollers, uh, controllers. Um, the most important thing is that it is meant for food. It's food safe. So the mat as well is made from food safe material. There's no adhesive on the mat. I just put a thin coat, uh, shortening down, and I put my gum paste on top. Okay. Will it also work with fondant? It will. If you're cutting fondant because it's so pliable, we recommend putting it on your mat and putting it in the freezer so it okay. becomes hard but not dry. Okay. And then it'll cut and then as it thaws, you can do whatever you want. Okay. So, gum paste, frosting sheets, fruit leather, cheese, tortillas, anything of that. Cheese and tortillas? Yeah, anything of this uh, consistency, you can cut. Really? So, we've okay. cut from like half a millimeter up to two and a half millimeters. Puff pastry. That's about a millimeter and a half. Okay. So I load my mat. Thank you very much. And will and my same cricket cartridges will work. Absolutely. Okay. Yeah. And we're making cartridges specific for cake that have a cake decor, cake decorations that will also work with your regular. Okay. So they're all interchangeable. I'm going to keep my speed at high. I'm going to keep my pressure at high. And these are pretty intricate. I'm going to cut them at three inches. And I'll hit. One of the creative features is also a plain image. And so if you're going to cut these images smaller, you can do a plain image that is less detailed. Okay. Maybe should have gone to a medium. But um, this one, this particular one is called tight the knot. Medium, it's one of the development. No, I can see it cutting in there. Some wedding-ish kind of thing. Yeah, that's pretty and detailed. It's, it's, it's very detailed. It's beautiful. Which one is that? Tight the knot. And up here in the front, we have a, it's called bird song. So it's, is Provocraft going to start going around the um, food shows? It's got like It was uh, actually filmed on a food show this week. It's got birds. So, it's got birds and birds. You'll see it. We'll start seeing it February on some shows. So now you're a professional cake decorator. We've been slaving away all day, and... So what is this? Is this gum paste? And we can buy it through you, or do we have to get it through? Okay, so let's, let's answer that question. Where do I get the gum paste from? Okay. We're going to sell the gum paste. Uh, we're going to sell the frosting sheets in sheets, the gum paste in tubs. You can buy gum paste with somebody else and roll it yourself. You can make it yourself. Now, gum paste, I could have taken your gum paste, you roll it back up, and you re-roll it like a sugar cookie dough, okay. and you can continue to cut. All right. Well, thank you. I appreciate it. Yep.